Hello and welcome to a quick look at what's new inside Mocha version 4. In Mocha v4 we have added export to the Nuke 7 tracker node. This was the highly requested feature from a number of users who liked using the corner pin but preferred the flexibility of the tracker node's options. Exporting to a Nuke tracker node is exactly the same as exporting to Nuke corner pin. You set your surface where you would like the exported track to be, select export tracking data, then select the Nuke 7 tracker. Just like other node exports, you can then just copy to the clipboard and move over to Nuke. Inside Nuke, we have the same footage and an example insert. We paste the tracker node into the node graph, and then open it up to take a look. When you double click on the node, you will immediately see the tracking data applied to the footage in the viewer. We can then choose to change the transform options, such as the reference frame if we wish, or leave all the transform parameters as they are. We can then select the type of export we want to create from the Nuke tracker node. Here we are just choosing to create a corner pin relative to the current frame. We select all our points and click create. This generates a new node to apply to the insert. We can then just merge the corner pin over the original footage to place the logo. And then set the input if we want it to conform to the original placement. The Nuke 7 tracker export gives users that extra flexibility so you're spending more time getting on with the job rather than trying to make different exports work for you. For more information on Mocha Pro and Mocha Plus V4, check out the website at imagineersystems.com.